Good news everyone, the iOS 7 jailbreak is here earlier than we expected. Currently it works on any iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch running iOS 7.0 through 7.0.4. The process is really easy and only takes a few minutes, so here's how it works. First, back up your iPhone or other iDevice. The jailbreak worked great for us on the first try, but problems do occur. Don't risk losing your data because you're eager and want to get started. Press that backup button. Download Evasion for your operating system, Windows or OS X. When the download completes, open up the Evasion README file to just double check your device meets all the requirements. When you're sure, open up the Evasion app. Connect your iPhone or other iDevice to your computer. If you have Passcode Lock enabled, go into the Settings app on your device and temporarily disable it in the General Passcode Lock section. You can re-enable it after the jailbreak is complete. Also, turn on airplane mode to prevent any updates or data-driven apps from interfering with the jailbreak process. Back on your computer, click the jailbreak button in the Evasion app window. It'll take a while to upload some necessary jailbreak data and your phone should restart during the process. Wait for Evasion to finish this step. As part of the process, Evasion installs a temporary jailbreak app on your device. When ready, it'll prompt you to open it. Simply unlock your device, then tap on the jailbreak icon. It'll cause the screen to flash briefly, but appear to do nothing. If you look at your computer, however, you'll see the jailbreak process continues. It'll finish in a minute or so, and you can close Evasion on your computer. Your device will need to reboot a couple of times, but when you see the lock screen, the process is done. Just navigate to Cydia, wait for it to set up the file system, identify yourself as a user, let it update everything it needs to update, and finally you can enjoy your jailbreak.